it to today's video. Today is Monday. Oh, it's so exciting to be back during the week. Like, I love our weekends, but lots of times we don't have plans, even though we used to always have plans on weekends, but things have changed now that we don't have a trailer, a horse trailer. Anyway, we're headed to the barn. Gabby's gone to run, or the girls are going to run to put the horses in before we leave. In the comments today, somebody said, to have Sophie ride chance in these because she's still struggling. Brandon doesn't want her touching his face at this at yet, and she still struggles uh, to know exactly how to not do that. Like when you're riding, you don't see what you're doing the same way you do when you watch back in a video. So, anyway, somebody suggested that we bring our rubber reins. Who remembers who we bought these for? Anyways, I'm grateful to have them. I love them. And Sophie actually likes this kind of rain. These are, these, I forget what the name of them are, but they're rubber. I call them rubber reins and I love them. I love rubber reins. That's what I ride Penny in. They're my favorite and I like the small ones too. Anyways, good morning. And I wanted to tell you guys that we are still on this journey with Chance and so you guys have been so awesome and so understanding. We're still looking for a saddle and the reason it's taking so long is because our fitter is looking for a used saddle. So we're waiting for the right saddle for the right saw in the right size to show up in all the sales places and it's not happening. So I think I'm going to ask her because he really needs a saddle. I think I'm going to ask her if we can like try at the, at the, saddle store and see like they don't tend to carry saddles actually i'm just gonna message the saddle store and see what they have come on laura think anyways so we're in this journey and today i asked brandon to give sophie her own private lesson we've been writing um we started now that it's summer we started we added somebody else to our private lesson like the girls usually have one private lesson it's just both of them together and then they have a group lesson but we added somebody to our, our private lesson, so now it's a group lesson. Now they're having two group lessons. Um, but Sophia, I feel, really needs to, like, have a private lesson on a chance until they work through a few things. Until we get the saddle fit, she's going to not look good on him because the saddle that he likes really puts her in an awkward position, which is not good for him. And so that's why I'm trying to expedite this process. But anyway, welcome to today. So let's go to the barn and see what kind of a miracle happens today. Because that's what I'm trying to focus on. I always think of myself as a positive person. But then when I watch back these videos, I always am focused on what could go wrong. Or what does go wrong. And I, even though it doesn't, I don't let that affect me or, or change my choices, I always am noticing them. And I don't even want to notice the stuff that goes wrong. I just want to learn to notice the good stuff. So come along. Let's go notice all the good stuff. I literally have so many things to look up. I also have like so many noses, horse noses, right here at the fence, at the gate, trying to get in. Anyways, I have so many things to look up. I need to get a new camera. And the reason I use this camera, even though it drives me crazy sometimes, is because it's really good in low light. Like the lighting is so good on this camera. It's the only reason I use this camera. But it has so many other flaws. But I'm never brave enough to like try another camera because they're expensive. So I don't know, like, what's gonna happen so I don't know like I, I need to find a new camera so I need to look that up but then also somebody else mentioned in the comments the activity that we've been doing with the ponies with the mares is called a pinwheel so now I want to look that up and try and figure out that like there's a lot of stuff I want to do but then if I don't write it down or I don't look it up right away I always forget about it does that happen to you guys windy oh my god it's windy this is the very first time ever that somebody's just gone and gone gotten her horse without locking all the other horses up very nice very nice uh oh they're just doing a circle oh my god they, they are making a pinwheel wow that was not good <laughs> i did want to ask you guys that why is chance's tail so short i've been looking like at other thoroughbreds and i noticed a lot of them have short tails so what is it is it a thoroughbred thing um i thought chance was going to speak because we had to go in front of the big truck yeah, everything's changed. They're plowing the or they're they're paving the driveway, and you thought Chance was gonna spook? Yeah, he only called to his friends because he's like, my friends aren't here. He normally does that. Yeah, he he's, likes his friends. He's a good leader. He's very late. Yeah. His reaction's very late. Yeah, everything about him is late. He's a slow boy. I had to bring some supplies, but we can't take it over there because they are paving the driveway, and I don't know if like they're coming over to this section. So I'm gonna put my wagon away. He said. 
that they'll take our grain and stuff over to the little barn when they're done, which is fine with me. I think I paid $25 for this little wagon. It's used. I thought it was free. No, I bought it from like a second hand off of Facebook. And it has saved me so much. I use it all the time. Yeah, yeah, I know. I always do this thing. Come on, Sophie, let's pick his feet and get him lunch. I always do this thing where I'm like, I, like if I have to be someplace at two and I have to leave at one, I'm always like freaking out because I have to leave by one. But then I'm always early for everything I ever do, like always. But if I haven't left by one or I'm like getting close to being late, I freak out. And then I'm always like, oh my gosh, we're gonna be late. And then, we get there and we're like an hour or an hour and a half early and everyone's like, what are you doing? Come on, let's go. <laughs> get freaking out. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Well, you better perk up, sister. Chance, <laughs> better perk up. Chance has said this is nap time. Yeah, can you go put this on Sophie's bridal, please? And, all right. Uh, just wait till she's done there. No, you go get it. So, why can't she ride in those? Oh yeah. Yeah, I like thinner ones too. Really? Yeah, like whenever I squeeze something. Really? Here, let me squeeze my hand. Oh, Gabby, that was a trick. Ow! No, like when I squeeze stress balls and stuff, I can barely squeeze. Okay, Gabby's stronger. Yeah, I think <laughs> I can't ride no, those either. They're, they're, too, they're too large. Oh, well, too bad. So sad. We're trying it, sister. We are trying it. I believe in it. We're going to do it. First, go get your bridle, please, so it can be ready. I also have to remember to text our... There's a lunger open here. What the heck? I didn't find anything, so Sophie, I'm gonna text the tax store and see if they have any saddles that could work for. Oh my gosh, where's a lunge rope? Is she talking about a lunge whip or a lunge rope? Because I do not see a rope. Do you guys see a rope? Anyway, I'm gonna do that right now before I forget. Did she say there's a lunge rope? No, she said lunge whip. I don't know, because I'm trying to do too many things at once because I, I'm coming in there with you. Hold on. Wait for me. Just out of the blue, I found a jack-o'-lantern. So, like I said before, Chance does not need to be lunged for energy. We, she just lunges him to get him paying attention to her and listening to her and remembering that she's in charge of him. Or sometimes just for pooping purposes. <laughs> I love how like friendly he is. I wish we could bring him home. Like we need a lot of work and a lot of help with him. So we can't bring him home. I mean, even if he did come home and we took him home and we kept him home for like a year and all they did was bond, I think that could even, like he's young enough that that could be like amazing. In another life, you guys. I thought he was gonna follow. Oh, he says don't roll. He goes to roll. He goes to roll. But you know, everybody needs a good roll. It's going down. 
I know you can never get the dust after a good roll. Painful watching Yeah, so I was like rushing. Hurry up, hurry up, we have to leave right now. And then we're here and we're just like sitting here watching our horses in the arena because we're early. He has such a nice looking horse. Have you seen the guy that like... Have you seen the guy that... Yes, that's Chance's poop. We have to clean it. Alright, here we go. It's gonna happen. It's the circle. The circle. So now the drop. Graceful. Yeah, it's funny. He always rolls down there, and our mares always poop at the end of the arena. <laughs> Look at him. He's just like so relaxed. Wow, you've been looking so graceful, Gino. Do you see that? That was like a dance. He laid down so beautiful and slow. He's like a ballerina of the horse world. Yeah, all that dirt's gotta come off now. Do you guys remember when we got these really nice shirts from Halter Equestrian? This one has the unicorn, so if you won that for, wore that for a long time. And this one says, Incurably, incurably Equestrian. And they're from Halter Equestrian. Anyways, I am, um, Sophie doesn't wear them anymore. I'm gonna give them to Shay. So that other coach that taught us last time, he's here again today. And he's teaching another girl. So I don't know, maybe he'll be here for like happy lesson. Lesson, I don't know. He, I talked to him the other day. And he said he is gonna be back. I better put this somewhere. He said he's gonna be back. He's gonna coach them again in another day. I like that he'll like stop in every once in a while and make sure they're remembering. Would you say if things ain't right? And then Brandon said that the girls are going to be living in a bounce to build up their horses and build up them. So I don't think this is it, but Sophie said that, that she thinks that this is going to be it. So Gabby's out there already riding, but um, Brandon got these two saddles for Sophie to try. And I'm excited to try them. I don't know how to try them though. These are nice saddles. Uh, I, I already learned a lot about saddles. I don't know if they're your size though. It's Can nice. I like it. I'm gonna have like this. Okay, I'm gonna have to have the saddle fitter look at them. Wow. What? Wow. Holy moly. So they're wool. So shit, that's nice. I don't know, I think that fits them almost. Um, I don't know if it'll fit Sophie. And I don't know if it's a bit tight in his shoulders, but I don't think it is. A wool saddle like this, see ours are foam, but a wool saddle like this, our saddle fitter can change the fit with the flock by changing the flock, moving it around. All right, you're gonna leave him in? Yeah. Gotta wash his bum too. I just dumped some water on 